Bunch of little little houses. Let's invade every house on this street. Yo. You Pokemon trainer? Sweet! Trade with me! I got I wanna get a tofu ring. If you have one, I will trade you my palige for it. <laughs> okay. That was a lot of words that I do not understand. <laughs> tofu rang, I believe. Didn't we fight that in the last gym? That giant hippo looking thing that get evolved from uh Tone Me? The Tandor Rangers work tirelessly to protect the environment and the citizens of this region. Make sure to always remember where you came from. Remember your roots, no matter how far away from home you get. I don't have roots. My mom died in a in a in a nuclear reactor explosion. And I've been living with my grandma ever since, so. I don't have roots. I'm a wanderer. I'm a vagrant. But it's still nice. You gotta remember your roots. Sup? I'm not actually gonna talk to you. I just wanted to look at you for a second because you're a weird looking dude. <laughs> Is he following me? Stop! <laughs> Trying my Pokemon in my game. I can beat my sister someday. I love that they're training in like a virtual environment. They're like training their Pokemon. <laughs> And it's like teaching them how to be like public servants in the future. That's really weird if everyone in this world grows up to be Pokemon trainers. One day my son tried to go into Comet Cave to catch his own Pokemon. I had to drag him back. What you got? You got loaded. This is a cool looking device you have loaded here. Got any good emails? I'm not gonna talk to him. Whoa, you got a whole other family in your second floor! And a Pokemon enthusiast! I see you're a trainer. Perhaps you can help me. I'm looking for one Pokemon in particular. I have no idea what it's called. I don't... I don't know what they're called either. A fat yellow snake. Is that... Popeye's kind of fat yellow. A Dunsparce! Oh yeah! It's so cute! I'm so happy! This is the best day of my life! We're making people's days! How can I ever repay you? A Moonstone? You're just in time. I was looking for this other Pokemon. It's a weak water type that gets really strong when it evolves. Uh, Marimba's a weak ass water type. I don't, I don't know. There's, there's lots of weak water types that get strong when they evolve. That's all my, that's all my water types. Can Popeye evolve from a Moonstone? Like, is that a thing? We need to try this. I don't know if any of my Pokemon evolved from weird items and junk. Moonstone. No. Sorry, Popeye. You're gonna stay... You're gonna stay a little Popeye forever. I don't know why Dunsparce would evolve. It just... They gave me one for Dunsparce. Hey there, stranger. How are ya? That's a cute bag you've got there. Would be a shame if anything would have happened to it. I'm gonna look at my items. There's gonna be a bomb in there. It's gonna be like Metal Gear Solid all over again. Because over there's crazy about Pokemon, but he never leaves the house. I wish he'd get a job. Oh, this is your cousin. I just thought this was like a uh, like two two people taking care of a kid here in this the top floor of this house. Which like that's cool. You know you got another family like upstairs. One day my son tried to go into Comet Cave to catch his own Pokemon. I had to drag him back. Oh, we've we've had this talk before. You've talked to me about this. Anyway, lovely home, sir. I'm gonna be I'm gonna leave. Look at you one more time. Yeah. The last thing you're gonna see before you die is me. It's me. I can go to the Mart. I can go to the Poke Mart and pick up a bunch of crap, can't I? Yo. Hello. You must be Zolan. I've received a gift for you. Here you go. Thanks, dude. We look forward to your next visit. We look forward to your next visit. Let's find out what all these things do. Oh, he gone. Bye, dude. That, that event just disappeared, didn't it? <laughs> didn't it, little, like, RPG maker ass video game? Destiny not. If the holder becomes infatuated, the foe does too. We do have a poison barb. I don't have any poison types. The sachet, filled with fragrant perfumes. Slightly too overwhelming, yet it's loved by a certain Pokemon. Yo, who loves stanky stuff? 
None of them. Aromatic Herb. Also loved by certain Pokemon, but don't know what. Huh, all right. Got this nugget, though. Yo, you want a nugget? I've got a nugget. Yeah, baby. Give me the good money. Yeah, I want to buy some stuff. Got super potions? You got that good stuff? Oh, you got super potions? You don't have full heals, though. All right, no full heals. Full heals are always a great investment. Pokeballs, I could get more Pokeballs. I'm gonna get two. It's not like I need a lot of them, but if I do, I wanna have good ones. Don't get me started on Sinnoh. It's borderline racist, I tell you. Ugh, Sinnoh. Is that third gen? I think, no. Hoenn is third gen, Sinnoh is fourth gen. Kanto, Johto, Hoenn. Sinnoh. Yeah. Hey, who's hating on Sinnoh? Who's hit? Who hates Sinnoh? Sinnoh's great. Full heals? I'm just talking about these. Those end up being too valuable for regular status conditions, so I never end up using them. You dumb. <laughs> you dumb kid. This is why you're, you don't have two gym badges right now, and I do. Look at them. You see those up there? That's two gym badges, like, right, like right there. Right there. I got those. You don't. Uh, y'all have a gym? I'm kind of doing that gym thing. Professor Cypress lives in Rockvale. Here she does all sorts of projects trying to improve communication between humans and Pokemon. She tries to talk telepathically with the Pokemans. Door's locked. There's a note on it. Temporary closed due emergency. I don't think this city's got a Pokemon gym. That's a bummer. Hey! Cypress, you doing a thing? So good, how was expected. It's good to see you, mate. But unfortunately, that wasn't the best time. There's been an emergency at Cypress Labs. We're all incredibly frustrated, so I went out to try to do something. Although, actually, running into you now might have been the luck to break we need. I can't explain. There's no time to explain. Come to the lab! Is always the last words you hear before an adventure begins. That's basically how Back to the Future started. I'll introduce you to Pokemon Professor Cypress and she'll give you the lowdown on what's happened. Yeah. Show me the Cypress. Sup? How goes telepathically talking to Pokemans? Bam! Oh, oh, you're back! Did you find the thief? Is it this kid? Listen, kid. Picked the wrong lab to break into last night. Hold up. Hold up, Lily Cypress. Great name, peak naming happening here. Hold on. This isn't the thief, this is Solon, my research assistant. They happen to be passing through town, they're a Pokemon trainer. Oh, Pokemon trainer, are they trustworthy? Of course they are. They're my assistant, aren't they? Besides, their father's Kellen, that ranger guy. Y'all remember Kellen? Oh, <laughs> Kellen's kid. You're Kellen's kid, all right, whatever. I suppose I can trust you. I am Lily Cypress, the Pokemon professor in this lab. You probably figured that out, but what's going on by now? Last night, while we were out, somebody broke into the lab. They stole many of the Pokemon. Wow, dang, that isn't good. Uh, it's strange. They completely ignored the most valuable thing in there. The money. <laughs> I usually leave out hundred dollar bills every night for in case thieves come out. But they left the money! <laughs> They left my Pokemon speech translator. It's cutting edge. We've been developing this. There's some who would go to great lengths to get their hands on it. Turns out, Pokemon don't say anything. They just say their name over and over. Who knew? Why would someone pe break in if they weren't trying to steal the PST? Who's this nerd? You're back. What did you find? Managed to recover one of the stolen Pokemon. This fellow was hanging out on Route 06. This is excellent, I have an idea. Let's use the PST on Oten to find out more about the thief. Yeah, you do what you gotta do. Scary, so scary. Was in my Pokeball asleep? All right, you say asleep. That's not my head cannon, but you go with it. You are asleep in your Pokeball. Suddenly I'm moving, but not human friend. 
taking me and others out towards Mountain Cave, dropped my Pokeball and got free! Dang, these Pokemon talk a lot. And, uh, that worries me a lot. <laughs> I don't want the Pokemon to be able to talk a lot. It'll make me feel even worse about making them fight each other. Towards the Mountain Cave, that must be in Route 6. Maybe the thief is still there. With the rest of the stolen Pokemon. Justice! Cypress is all about that justice. With the rest of the stolen Pokemon, this could lead. Somebody can give that Pokemon a treat for its hard work. And the question is, how do we catch a thief? We have to steal from the thief. How else do you catch a thief? All right, they could be dangerous. I've got, I've got two badges already. I'm pretty good. I think I'm pretty good. Am I pretty good? Am I good? Am I good, guys? Ah, I'm good. I'm good. We got this. According to O10, the thief on, is still on Route 6 to the west. If you'd look into it, we'll be all be in your debt. I love it when people are in my debt. This is perfect. In order to help with your investigation. Oh, I know. Why don't you borrow the PST? Uh, I don't want to touch that thing. Ah, oh, crap. That's kind of cool, though. So can I just talk to, like, any Pokemon now by, like, interacting with them? Hey. Oh, yeah. I'm home, but missing friends. Where are friends? Scary! Where are friends? Scary! Oh, ten, it's okay. Oh, ten's still nervous after the whole ordeal. I'm comforting it. Can I use the PST to not have to talk to people anymore? Can they just make Pokemon noises now? Because that would that'd be fine with me. Whoa, dang, dude, you got two computers. You know you have two computers in this place? <gasps> However, now is not the time for fossil revivication. We're in the state of emergency. Don't panic, don't panic, everything's gonna be fine! I mean, I'm not in a state of emergency. I'm in the state of rock fail! Where rocks fall. Also, my, uh, my rival and friend is still trapped out, like, behind that cave. We should probably do something about that. But whatever, I'm just gonna pick these berries. I'm gonna take all these berries. Because I can't be asked to, like, horticulture every five seconds. Oh boy, that's a lot of O10. I wanted to sneak through. I'm out in the field to catch a Pokemon for the press, but that's boring! Professors always get you get you out to catch Pokemon for them. Hate that. Owen does not have an O10. I was kinda hoping Camper Owen would have an O10. Ooh, Tencoon here is kinda beefy. I don't want him to roar though. Or, uh, Howl. I'm worried about Howl's coming out. Because that bite's going to be tough. Okay. Not too bad. As long as it's in crit, we're not in a bad situation. Perfect. Great. Wonderful. Just jet on through, Flash. Only problem is I've got a ton of underleveled Pokemon at this point. Oh, never mind. They've only got a level 18. Then we're in a good pot. We're in a good spot. All right, back down, back down to heal. Yo. So they're not gonna budge. They seem unwilling to budge. The bad Pokemon is out there. I'll just throw poke balls at all of you. Is that legal? I don't think that's how that works. Ten, ten. Oh, do I have to fight? No humans allowed. I do have to fight Pokemon. Oh no! I just have to like randomly fight O tens. Oh, sorry, sorry, Flash. Let's get you out of there. I've got tons of electric choices. That's for sure. Uh, <laughs> I should go check to see if um, our Mary actually has a uh, electric attack. Dang, O10, that's not gonna look at what O10, are you okay? You look stoned. You look really messed up, my friend. <laughs> Those eyes do not look great. Sorry, dude. Well, if we're fighting a whole bunch of O10, let's just put Mary in pole position. 
The Batman. It is never time to kill the Batman.